Update on Antonio Conte, Tottenham manager has chance to witness Man City match. Antonio Conte had a gallbladder operation earlier this week, but he might not be confined to his bed to watch the match against Manchester City. Following a gallbladder procedure, Antonio Conte might return to the Tottenham bench for the match against Manchester City on Sunday. According to NHS guidelines, a decision is scheduled to be made on Saturday. A typical recuperation time should be three to four weeks. Pressing the subscribe, like, and or comment buttons and sharing with your closest friends will help support this channel. Many thanks. Following complaints of discomfort during the FA Cup victory against Preston last weekend, Conti, 53, underwent surgery on Wednesday. However, when asked if he would be watching from home, his aide, Christian Stellini, responded, We don't know yet, the decision will be decided on Saturday. We are prepared to take any action, but Antonio and the medical professionals who performed his surgery will likely make the final decision. We have two days and 48 hours to make a choice. There is time. Anything is conceivable. He is healing nicely from surgery, which went smoothly. He is currently at home. Whatever happens, Conti will assist in selecting the squad to take against the reigning Premier League winners, according to Stellini. We'll do it together, he added. Since Antonio isn't present to judge the training and everything else, I'll describe it to him and we'll make the decision together. As soon as he was able to following his operation, Conti began inquiring about the match up with City, according to Stellini. It is normal to not feel energetic after surgery to discuss, the game, he continued. However, as soon as he had fully recovered from the procedure, he called me again and we began to discuss practice and the next match. Stellini elaborated on the moment when Conde's backroom crew became aware of the issue, it was Antonio who phoned me and described the scenario. He had a difficulty last week that we mistook for illness, not something like this. We believed it to be more influenza. We assume that because so many of our athletes have the flu every week, but after his scans to determine how he was feeling, they realized there was a greater issue when they had to take the necessary action. Although he was upset about it, we had to continue working. Before the procedure, Antonio and I had a chance to talk about how we would be ready for the upcoming match. When it came time for him to have the surgery, both before and after, we lost him for 12 hours. The procedure was straightforward, and a speedy recovery is crucial. The most crucial factor is this. John Piero Ventroni, Sinisha Majlovic, and John Luca Violi were close friends of Condi's, and all passed away during those trying six months. Stellini declined to comment on whether the Spurs manager's most recent setback may have been caused by stress. There is no way to know, he continued. If there is a connection between these items, I'm not sure. We must accept the circumstances and live in the present. Antonio may need to accept the circumstances more. Although it's difficult for him to be apart from us, his health comes first. Conde's future is still in question, but Stellini claimed the team is now in good shape, with even Brazilian star Lucas Moura participating after a season marred by injuries. No injuries, he assured. We are pleased to announce that Lucas is also back, since he has been training this week. He returned after playing for the junior squad for 45 minutes, 